by calculus lesson 7 tangents of normals question 1 we have to find the equation of a tangent to the curve function x equals 2x squared plus 3x plus 1 at the point where x equals negative 1 first of all we'll find out what the function value is so at x equals negative 1 function negative 1 equals 2 times minus 1 squared plus 3 times minus 1 plus 1 and that comes out to 2 minus 3 plus 1 which gives 0. Now let's consider the function and to work out the gradient of the tangent of x equals minus 1 we'll have to differentiate this function and that gives me, according to the rule, 2 comes down, that's 4x plus 3. So at function f dash minus 1, we get minus 4 plus 3, which equals negative 1. So we have our gradient. We have a point. Now using the formula, y minus y1 equals m outside of x minus x1 we get y minus 0 equals minus 1 outside of x um, plus 1 which gives you y equals minus x minus 1 or in general form x plus y plus 1 equals 0 Well, right, in question two, we have to find the equation of the normal to the curve function x equals to root x at the point where x is equal to four. Now, <clears throat> at x equals four, function will be equal to root four, and the square root of four is two, and two times two is four. Now, for this function, I have to put it in the index, <coughs> excuse me, index form, which is 2x to the half. Differentiating this, we get f dash x equals a half, comes down, multiplies it by 2, which makes it 1, and take it 1 becomes x to the minus a half, which is 1 over the square root of x. Now, at, at 4, we get 1 over the square root of 4 which is going to be a half now uh, so we know that the gradient of the of the tangent is a half therefore the gradient of the tangent is equal to a half Therefore, the gradient of the normal must be equal to negative 2. So we've got the point, and we've got the gradient. So again, using y minus y1 equals m outside of x minus x1. We'll put in the y1, which is equal to 4, the gradient of the normal, which is negative 2 and the x value which was 4 and that gives me y minus 4 equals minus 2x plus 8 and putting this in general form again we get 2x plus y minus 12 equals 0 as the equation of our normal All right, in question three, we have to find the equation of the tangent to the curve function x equals 2 over x at the point where x equals 1. Now, at x equals 1, we have function 1 is simply 2 over 1, which is 2. And again, we have to re rearrange the function 
an index form, so we've got this 2, x and negative 1. And when we differentiate this, we're going to get minus 2, x to minus 2, which is minus 2 over x squared. So f dash 1 is simply going to be equal to minus 2 over 1 squared, which is minus 2. Right, so now we have the points, and we've got the other point and the, the gradient, so we need to rewrite this as y minus y1 equals m outside of x minus x1. And put those points in. So it's y minus the y value was 2. The gradient was minus 2. And the x value was 1. So this is y minus 2 equals minus 2x plus 2. Putting it in general form, we get 2x plus y minus 4 is equal to 0. This is our equation of our tangent. Okay, the last example, question 4, is uh, a bit more challenging. Um, is to find the equation of the, of the normal to the curve function x equals 4 over the cube root of x at the point where x equals 8. So just pause the video and see if you can do this one. All right, now at x equals 8, we have function 8 equals 4 over the cube root of 8. Cube root of 8 is 2. 4, over, 4 divided by 2 is just 2. Again, rearranging this in index form, we have 4x to the... Now, this will be minus a third. So when you differentiate this, be careful with the signs. You'll get minus 4 thirds. And reduce this by 1 makes it minus 4 thirds. Which is minus 4 thirds times 1 over the cube root of x all raised to the fourth power. So when we put in the 8, f dash 8, we're going to get minus 4 thirds times 1 over the cube root of 8 to the power 4, which is, you can bring out your calculator, we can do this, you should be able to do this in your head, now, the cube root of 8 is 2, 2 to the 4th is 16. And of course, that cancels with that, and you get minus 1 over 12. Now, this, that's the gradient of the tangent. So tangent is minus 1 12th. So this means that the normal is the to reciprocal, because they're right angles to each other, and that's equal to 12. Now, we're ready to go with the y minus y1 procedure again. So it's get y minus, and the y value was 2. Our gradient was 12. Our x value was 8. So y minus 2 equals 12x minus 96. And in general form, that becomes 12x, taking y across, minus y, adding the 2 to minus 96 becomes minus 94 equals naught is the general equation for the normal of this curve at the point x equals 8.